Welcome back to the channel, it's Froned here, and today we, well, we're doing one more thing before we start Big Ben. So, I finished up here last episode and dropped back to this corner for the start of this episode. And I've got a little plan. So, as we've all got great plans, you've got to have a backup. So, once we turn that siren on, we're kind of setting ourselves up for disaster. It's gonna be an absolute nightmare we only got one plank from that it's gonna be just carnage really and i need either a backup escape route or just some sort of escape plan and i've come up with a bit of an idea so what i kind of want to do is for one get this house barricaded all round so we get all all the windows rebuild some doors because we're running very low on doors for some reason they just destroyed that corner house and I can't quite remember why could have been a helicopter there not sure, either way carnage but yeah, what I'm kind of thinking we've got a little bit of axe left so if we need some trees, we need some trees but what I want to do is build like a little stairs bit over in this corner and just have like a perch, maybe in that corner. Yeah, that way we can see both sides of it, I guess. But yeah, I reckon I reckon we build some stairs up over here. So we can have a little look around, see what's going on. And just have like a clear backup escape route. And that looks like a cool building. Wouldn't mind seeing what's going on around there. But yeah, first things first. Actually got two door hinges and the door knob. It's a rare sight. Oh, have I got a can opener? I do. It's on the ball somewhere. All right, let's just start breaking things down so I can see it getting pretty chaotic. But first things first, I would love to get a door in there. And we've got the perfect amount of planks. Carpentry, one wooden door. And she goes, beautiful. Have a quick morning smoke, wherever the cigarettes are. There we go. Yeah, this house isn't really the best one for it. <laughs> Get those barricades up. Wonder if we've got enough. Hey, two hinges and the doorknob. Again, result. So I reckon once we start on the beds and things, life would just be so much smoother. Even the sofa, that turned out quite nicely. What you got for us? Just a single bed. Where the hell did you come from? Get out of here. Well, there's a uh, reason number one why to check every single corner. Christ. <laughs> I think that's the most calm and collected jump scare I've had in a very long time. <laughs> So I've already checked the rest of them, so should be all good. So I saw, saw the sheet right round back and had to check this house out before anywhere else. Um, is that as full? No, not quite. I wonder how much I get out of these. Only one. Probably worth doing, to be fair. Doors are good too. One plank. And we may as well just do this door. Yeah, another plank. Lovely. Should give us... What's that? Two windows? Yeah. Well, finish off the back window and get the front door in. Nice. Feel like we could possibly ignore you for a bit. See ya. Can't remember where I left all of the shotgun gear. Did I leave it at home? Might have left it at home. One, two, three, and four. Nice. Any curtains? Yes, and one more window. Uh, remove curtain. So I wouldn't mind getting a sheet rope upstairs just for just for safety, really. A nice little backup route. Chances are I probably won't need it, but you just never know. One, two, three, and four. 
Oh no, that's number three, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, there's a mortar and pesto in there. I haven't seen one of those in a very long time. Got a plank. I got no nails. Got a whole box of nails. Got seven boxes of nails. Well, I really didn't need those, did I? <laughs> One sheet. Why am I so overweight all of a sudden? I mean, that definitely doesn't help. It's never been repaired, so I don't want to waste it, but don't really want to carry it either. Hmm. Strange. Disassemble. Nothing. Classic. Uh, can't even do that, can we? Nope. Maybe there's a single bed up here. Yeah, boy. Let's get this window open too. Let's add ourselves a escape rope. Craft a sheet rope. Ah, oh, I did a silly. Oh, I did a silly. Oh, no, I didn't. Oh, I need two, don't I? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Pants. Craft sheet rope. Get a ton. As many as we can get. And we got a backup if they decide to tear them down. Nice. Alright, last but not least. Beautiful. One fortified house. Cool. That took a hell of a lot longer than I thought it would. Did get some food out of this though, didn't we? Peaches and chili. Beautiful. There's dinner covered. Spears almost there. Slowly but surely. Alright, where's... Where the food at? I have one load of canned chili. I reckon we save the peaches for the morning. Probably about time we get some sleep. But yeah. I think stairs come around tomorrow. It's going to be the way to do it for sure. Build a little parrot over there and then we can just hop over if need be. Oh, those sheet ropes could actually come in handy. So if I build like a fence on either side so we can just climb down rather than rather than risking it all. Wouldn't be ideal. Imagine that jumping off and fracturing our leg. <laughs> Typical. So it's probably a little bit sketchy doing it with, uh, with a sheet rope. But sometimes the extra bit of time is worth it. But yeah, let's... Let's get and break down some beds. There's bound to be a few more doubles along here. Get those sofas down first. Oh, we need 12, don't we? We need 12 planks. Off to a good start, though. Take as many nails as I can. Oh, come on. <laughs> there we go. Four planks. Not bad. Right, that's almost enough. For the big boy. Four, eight. believe we need four more. Fifteen. Christ. I feel like that's gone up. Four, eight. Uh, should we just chop down a tree? What's that? Three, six. Still not quite enough. I forget how long carpentry takes. <laughs> so as soon as I hit level 10, I don't do it for so long that... Yeah, it just goes. Get one more in there. Would have been nice to get three, but I'll take two. I'll take two. So it should give us just enough to build what we want up top too. Um, I, yeah, I would like to step it back one. Carpentry, wooden floor. Okay, yeah, this this is the sole reason we're doing this. It's a shame we can't see right along the fence line. 
Unless we build one further out, maybe. It's not quite going to cut it, is it? Yeah, I wonder how far we need to go. I feel like I should take a chance and... Oh man, that was a big chance. Big, big, big chance. Okay, now uh, we can't be doing that. So I just wanted to see what the reaction would be. I guess we could build a little bit further along. Yeah, yeah, let's, let's just get a better picture. Wasn't expecting that to open. Even more surprised I've got a key. Christ. That was terrifying. Got lucky that he got got knocked a bit. <laughs> Get out of here. I ain't playing no games, son. I'll switch out to this. Hand axes are good. Five overall, I wouldn't mind a couple more. Yeah, one will do. Ah, uh, or oh, will it? Ooh, two at the table. That's a rare sight. Polish off that brown sugar. Let's get straight to her. But yeah, I would just like to know how many I need to be able to see over the wall. As soon as I can see over the wall, I'll be somewhat happy. Come on then. Oh, wrong weapon. I'm going to go do that with a hammer. Christ, we're slow moving with this much weight. I think that would be more than enough. Oh, that's really annoying. I don't want to go too much further than that because it feels a bit feels a bit naughty. Yeah, even that. I know we're only one one story up, but I think we'd be able to see. If I set a pillar under that corner, I feel feel less bad. <laughs> uh, what do you reckon? Play the game? Yeah. I mean, realistically, we should be able to see anyone that comes down to this point anyway. Playing a brave game here. Oh yeah, especially with our weight. Ah, not weight, sorry. Exhaustion. I think that should be more than enough. Two, four. No, it's three, isn't it? Two, four, six, twelve overall. Three planks per log. Yeah, that's spot on. One wooden wall. Gotta keep that structural integrity. So that's my one one pet peeve about a lot of builders on this game. So you can build a ridiculous structure, but if they don't have structural integrity. It just ain't it, son. I mean I say a lot of builders, I don't think I've seen seen too many builders at all and most of them tend to do it <laughs> can we not climb that 
don't think we can. Oh, well. At least we can hop the fence. I wonder. Now that that's there. What can we see? Still nothing. But we can see surrounding that. Okay. That's better. That's way better. Let's just climb our way up. Get ourselves rested. And relax. Cool. Alright, can we get anything else in here? Just to tell us over. Can definitely bang some nails into that, for sure. Where is it? There we go. The best weapon for this reason. You pretty much just got an unlimited weapon here. So you end up just doing like 1% of the time, but so good. So this cost us... Ah, I've never done that before. Can actually remove a bit of... Um, what do you call it? Durability. If you get a dodgy nail in there. Ah, that is interesting. Also very cool. Are we level... Not quite. I would like that book though. Come in handy very soon I reckon. Alright, where did I want to go? Um, ah, distillery is all the way up there. That is annoying. This place isn't really somewhere we want to be hanging about. Maybe we just go through these ones and round up as much food as we can. Never know when you're going to get stuck. Or, oh, even better, let's just, just clear the way. Make the most of this bat. So I wouldn't mind. Wouldn't really mind leaving it behind if I can. Annoying. It's fairly quiet down here. Guessing all the carnage over at the hospital. Oh, no, nope, the church. <laughs> over at the church is sort of. Taking all of them out. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. This could actually be a fairly safe route after all. Come on, fella. There we go. Oh. Hefty miss swing. See ya. Any more for any more? One miles away. And a little group. Guess we can take care of them. Nice. Last but not least. Ooh. nice to get some long blunt in for a change so it almost almost adds that little layer of fear back so it's all good all good having level 10 in a weapon but you do get used to it it does make life a hell of a lot easier there we go <laughs> just ridiculous all right i'm gonna go get some sleep ah uh, you know what nah let's Let's do the rounds. So I think this side is just dead quiet. So see what we can stock up. Hopefully not set off any house alarms. Wouldn't mind getting some wood glue though. Wood glue would be wonderful. Uh, you are both incredible. Olive oil is just calorie central. Yeah, boy. All the tins we can get. Um, definitely take the brew. Thank you, sir. Alright, we're checking 
all our corners this time. Not playing that game. Electronics free. Have I got that? Yeah. Don't really know. I doubted it. Oh, you know what I do need, though? One notebook. Just fill those up. So I'd be, be more than happy to replace it. Ooh. And that is a welcome sight. I love these units. Oh, do we have any bandages? Yeah, we got two. I remember grabbing some, but couldn't remember if it was this uh this bag or another. There you go. More on the board than I think. Straight back on the biz. Did not know that window was broken. See ya. Nice. On to the next. So I'll probably just get this little strip done. This strip's actually a lot longer than I thought. <laughs> We're only two houses down. Oh, it might actually be worth keeping a keeping a jar of coffee on us. If we get tired whilst on the move, that's gonna be a game changer. Christ. I got a lot more food a lot faster than I thought. Metal working one. Don't really need any of these. JS2000 shotgun. Unload and rack. That's something we can absolutely use. Carpentry 4. It's been a long, long time since I needed one of those. I might just spend the night in this house. Looks very well stocked. Very brief look in the kitchen. Decent gear on the kitchen sides. Ooh, a bunk bed. These are great for wood, by the way. Nice. Alright, let's have an entire bottle of wine. Might even just have something else too. Um, corned beef. Great for calories. Be rude not to. Where'd you go? There you go. Nice. Alright, let's get some sleep. I can't get no sleep. Hopefully it's an early-ish bird. 7.40. Yeah, not bad. Pipe wrench. Love a pipe wrench. So good. Now what we got, what we got, what we got. Maple syrup. Ooh, the maple kind. Ah, oh, rotten bowl of cereal. Rotten bread. So sad seeing it all go. Ah, oh, straight in the kitchen on this one. Ooh, a pretty good haul too. Even better. Or even butter, if you will. Cocoa powder. Cocoa powder is actually really good. Can't believe I almost slept on that one. Ah, no rubber ducks today. Comic books. All the fun stuff. Oh, we are actually really starting to slow down now. Trapping two. Yeah, nothing we need. Mechanics 5, that's definitely something we do need. Need 4 first, but I'll take it. 
Oh, I thought that was going to be it then. Uh, we don't... No, we don't. We're way higher than Taylor and 2. Christ. On the way to Taylor and 6. And last but not least, I believe. Ah, oh, great. Wonderful. Nice, nice, nice. One quick scope around the kitchen. Again, this place is just pulling through. House after house. Nice. Nothing we really need, but always nice to know. Vitamins. Come to Papa. The more wake up juice we can get, the better. Uh, first aid level 2. Why not? Why not? Nothing too crazy. That's a pretty good toolbox. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's basically all we're going to get out of these. Let's head back. Unload everything we can. I thought it was outside then. My heart just did a little jump. Ah, you're outside. See ya. And thanks for the knife. Uh, should we put it all upstairs? Ideal world it would have gone in there, but fortunately this is not an ideal world. In the words of Rick Rams. Um, yeah, let's just bang all of it in there. Oh, so much better. Feel that weight fall off his shoulders. Get the books in there too. Pop. Juice box. White wine. Keep the bourbon on us maybe. All of this stuff. God, we filled that up. We've still got more to go. Guess we can have some canned corn now. Nice. One empty tin. Or the body. Alright, let's grab those sheet ropes, go build a fence on each bit, and get an escape rope off the corner. What is it? One or two? Or a fence? Two. Might be easier to just chop down another tree. That'll do, actually, won't it? Yeah. Already got one plank. One log. Saw logs. One wooden fence. Perfect. It's always super sketchy walking along these. I hate it. Absolutely hate it. You just gotta do what you gotta do. Ah. Okay, I guess we need two. Oh, I guess it's like jumping out of a window, really, isn't it? Yeah, I get it. Craft sheet rope. One and two. Two sheet ropes. Add one escape rope. Nice. That uh, should give us a lot more mobility on the way down. Yeah, nice. We're straight on the move. Result. I've just got to hope that they don't get torn down. I'm sure we'll be alright. But, as always in Projects on Board, there's only one way to find out. But yeah, I think for now, I'm going to love you and leave you right here. So I think in the next episode, I'm pretty much going to head back home. 
grab our fire truck, get locked and loaded, and yeah, cause some carnage. But yeah, I'm gonna love you and leave you just here. Thanks for watching. Massive thanks to the support on the channel. Like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Hopefully, stick around for the next one. Peace.